Welcome to a new Draw My Life video. Mario is the protagonist of the video game saga Super Mario Brothers and an icon of the Japanese video games company Nintendo. Even though he's Italian-American, hence his moustache, his dad is the Japanese Shigeru Miyamoto. He was born in 1981 under the name of Jumpman. Back then, our friend was a carpenter and his mission was to save his girl from Donkey Kong. It wouldn't be until 1983, when, already under the name of Mario, in honor to Mario Segale, president of Nintendo American back then, Nintendo released Mario Brothers, accompanied by Luigi, his little brother, for the Nintendo Entertainment System, better known as NES. Mario's story starts when baby Mario and baby Luigi were flying towards their parents' house with the stork, but Kamek, Bowser's vassal, the everlasting and evil villain, fearing that the star children would ruin the Koopa's troop plans, kidnapped Luigi and let Mario fall on the Joshi Island. When the Koopas realized one baby was missing, they tried to kidnap baby Mario. With the help of the Joshis, baby Mario managed to defeat Kamek and the leader of the troop, baby Bowser. They rescue baby Luigi and the store, who takes them to their parents in Brooklyn, New York. But poor them, they didn't know their kids were star children. Years go by and Mario becomes a headache to his family. He was very naughty at home. When he was seven, Mario grew a big mustache. A little later, Mario and his brother get a degree from the Plumbers Academy with the highest grades among the graduates in their class. Mario decides to start with Luigi's help the plumbing company Mario Brothers Plumbers. During their repair of a bathtub, both brothers were accidentally absorbed by a pipe which took them to the Mushroom Kingdom. From cleaning pipes to rescuing the princess of the kingdom, Peach. Our favorite plumbers will bring peace back to the Mushroom Kingdom and will save it from the claws of Bowser and his followers. Always advised by Toad and held by Joshi. But Bowser is very elusive and our princess Peach is always in trouble. So Mario and Luigi will have lots of kingdoms to free and many adventures to live. They will save more young ladies in trouble and will defeat more villains, thanks to the power of the mushrooms, which will give Mario a second chance apart from other qualities. We also have the stars, which will turn Mario into Super Mario and a lot more transformations. Raccoon Mario and the evolution to Mario Tanuki, Fire Mario, Frog Mario and many others. Mario is characterized by his short height and his chubby shape. Of course, without forgetting about his characteristic moustache. As any good plumber, he wears blue overalls and a red t-shirt. He also wears a red cap with his name's initial printed on it. Sometimes he wears red overalls and a brown t-shirt instead. The idea of the cap was born because it was difficult for graphic designers at that time to animate Mario's hair when he jumped. And same thing with the moustache. It was easier than drawing a smiley face. His brother Luigi also follows the same style, varying the color, green, his height and his weight. Mario loves pizza and pasta so much that he even dreams about them. Mario is a kind character of a noble heart. He loves his brother Luigi so much. He also shares some feelings with Princess Peach, but they only love each other as friends. Information that would need to be confirmed though. He loves adventures, he's humble, calm and a good-natured person. The plumber doesn't like talking very much, only grumbling and saying some Mamma mia! It's -a me, Mario! Here we go! Or Okie dokie! We'll do for him! From the 90s, Mario competes against Sonic, the mascot of Sega, Nintendo's main rival. During more than a decade, both have developed different games with Mario and Sonic as protagonists, trying to surpass the other. But in 2002, this rivalry came to an end. Due to a partnership between Sega and Nintendo, Sonic became one of the characters in Mario's games. He became, therefore, an ally and friendly competitor. 
But if we want to talk about rivalry, we have to mention Wario, our Mario's dark side. He is his complete opposite, selfish, greedy, manipulative, and evil. Wario has always envied Mario because of his fame. Just as Wario, we also have Waluigi, Luigi's dark side, who along with Wario fights everyone. They even fight against Bowser. Mario has had several jobs. Doctor, demolition worker, boxing referee, painter, archaeologist, sportsman, runner, just as many jobs as games released by Nintendo. This unstoppable hero has been entertaining the whole world for 30 years, and we hope he keeps doing it for another 30 years at least. Come on, Mario! If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it. And if you want to see more Draw My Life videos, subscribe to our channel. See you in the next episode.